Good evening, people. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, everybody. Good evening, teacher. I'm Mauricio. I'm here. How are you tonight? Well, fine. Fine. <laughs> and you? Oh, mm -hmm. Good. 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 Not, not sick. Well, I can still feel any smell not the smell no uh, what day is it? Uh, right now one week one week one week with no smell no smell i i no smell um, equal five days or more because sinusitis. Oh. oh, but I can breathe. Oh, I I say I say sinusitis. God, <laughs> I I do I do not prove. PCR no. or antigen? No. 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 Me neither. <coughs> Supongo. ¿Cómo se le dice supon en inglés? Suppose. I suppose. Suppose. I suppose. Suppose. Eh, sí, no, sí. Que... <laughs> Good evening. Good evening, Zaira. Acá probando mi micrófono está bien, se escucha bien. Yes. Perfect. Okay. Thank Very you. good. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. So is is that a new headset, Saira? Uh, repeat, teacher. It's a new headset. <laughs> yes, it's new. Oh. I need buy. No, como dice, no sirve. No sirvieron los otros. El micrófono se me les apinó, teacher. Ah. Oh. Uh -huh. Teacher, aquí estoy. Buenas noches. Good evening. Hey, Ana Lilia. Sí. Welcome estoy, ya back. Ya apagué el internet. <laughs> Confesiones. Yeah. That happens. That happens. And they don't forgive. And no perdonan. Okay. 
Okay, everybody start studying from And how are you doing with the platform? Are you working on the platform? Yes, teacher, yes. Okay, that's good. Let me check. Here. Number one. Okay, okay, that's good. Bien, sí, veo que hay varios que ya están trabajando en la plataforma. Aunque hay varios todavía en cero no debería de estar en cero Okay, good evening again. Let me take the first attendance to start tonight. It's good to see you again. Hello, good evening. Good evening, Jonathan. Okay, let's get it started with the attendance. Anna Lillian Reyes. Present. Welcome back. Brian Javier Carmona. Okay, good evening, Brian. Dinora Alejandra Alfaro. Present teacher. Excellent. Good evening, Dinora. Good to see you. Frida Janine Mejia. Present teacher. Okay. Welcome. Gabriela Irene Menjivar. Guillermo Antonio Garcia. Javier Aldair Escobar. Javier Ayet. Uh, José Arnoldo Mazariego. Present teacher. And good evening. Good evening. Good evening. José Galileo Barrera. Present. Welcome. José Jonathan Vigil. Present. Excellent. Good evening. Good evening. José Rodrigo Hernández. Present. Hey. Good to see you tonight. What happened yesterday? Uh, oh, mechanic my car. Oh. Okay. Teacher, yes. I get the audio. I audio. I get the audio. I get the audio. Yeah. I block the microphone right now. Okay. Catherine Marcela Castaneda. Present teacher. Okay. Good evening. Um, remember, uh, Marcela, to write your full name, please. 
Ah, okay, teacher. Okay, thank you. Laura Carolina Vigil. Present, teacher. Good evening, Laura. Good evening. Maria Concepcion Cerón. Present, teacher. Okay, good evening, very fresh. Good evening, teacher. Maria Ivania Palma. Maria Ivania, not yet. Mauricio Antonio Rivera. Por aquí estaba, pasó. Mayra Veralice Moreno. Present. Okay, welcome Mayra. Zaira Marlene Larín. Present teacher. Good evening, Zaira. Wendy Maribel Zabaleta. Present teacher. Excellent. Welcome. Uh, Jacqueline Gloribel Rivas. Present. Very good. Good evening. Lia Sael Matute, not anymore. Karen Vanessa Morataya. Present. Very good, welcome. Thank you. Mauricio Antonio Orellana. Present. Welcome. Rocio Lourdes Pimentel. Present. Welcome. And Jocelyn Joanna Garcia. No. That's... Okay. Junior is. Okay, people. Teacher. Yes. <laughs> Eh, no menciona mi nombre, me acabo de unir, es que todavía estoy eh, llegando a casa. Ah, ok, ok, no problem. Javier Aldair. Ok. Good night, teacher. Good evening, Guillermo. Welcome. Thanks. Ok. Well. Last night we finished with some questions about um, you and your company. So I like to continue a little bit with that to make a short review. Let me share the screen with you to look for that. Oops, let me make sure I see this. Who's writing in the chat? Oh, uh, okay, okay. Would be nice if, at least for the attendance, you can turn on your cameras, people. Okay, what is the thing here and the three questions we had last night? Where can I find you if I visit your company? What can I get from your company? And what can you do for me if I visit your company? Okay, we have these three questions. Let me see if I can write them in the chat. So closed. Okay, there you have in the chat the three questions because I want you to practice. We are going to practice with this. Let me start with one of you. Tonight is eight and eight in the list is Jose Arnoldo Mazariego. Well, we did it last night, but we can do it again. 
Okay, Arnoldo, first question. Where can I find you if I visit your company? Your microphone, Arnoldo. Microphone. Sorry, teacher, you can find you can find me in the warehouse in the second floor. Very good. And what can I get from your company? You can get all about the electrical material for from begin to the end of the home installation. Okay. And what can you do for me if I visit your company? I can give you a tour for the store and I can offer a special discount for your buy. Okay, thank you. Now You're choose welcome. choose a, a partner and ask these questions to him or her. Um, Frida. Okay. Uh, Hello. Frida, where can I find you in your business company? You can find me in the sixth floor, uh, sixth floor in, in the clinic. Okay. What can I get from your company? You get, you get in my company a PPO service key, a, because it's a call center. What can you do for me if I visit your company? Um, I attend, if it's necessary, I can attend a, I don't know, I don't know. You Sorry. Can I can attend you. Yeah. I can attend you uh, yeah. for medical issues. Oh, okay. Thank you so much. Okay, thank you. Una inyección. Frida, una inyección. Yeah, an, an, an yes. Yeah, a shot. An injection too. A nisplin. <laughs> no, please. <laughs> okay, Frida, can you ask these questions to another classmates? Eh, sorry, teacher, estoy de oyente y no, no tengo las question, eh, the question in my, a la mano. No uh, tengo mi compu. Uh, well, I put them in the chat, but if you... If ah, you okay, sorry. Right now, yes, really. Okay, no problem. We can choose someone else. Okay, so, um, Zyra. It's a educator. Now you, Saira, ask, choose a classmate and ask the questions to him or her. I put the questions in the chat so you can read them. Okay. Yo las tengo acá, teacher. Okay, no problem. Who are you going to ask these questions? A quien, teacher? Yeah, yeah, you choose. Is your is your choice? Um, se las tengo que preguntar a alguien. Es que no le estoy comprendiendo. Yes, and you are going to choose that person. You select the person, the, the student. No lo veo. Okay, if not, give me a number. Um, Jose Galileo. Okay, Galileo. <coughs> Thank you. Go ahead, Saira, ask him. Where can I find you if I visit your company? Hmm. If, you, if you visit my company, you can find me at the production plant. Okay. Number two. Number what? two. What? Hi. Oh, continue. Okay. 
What can I get from your company? You can get from my company the most better pizza in El Salvador. There are pasta, cheese sticks, salad, and more delicious products to eat. Okay. One more. Number three. What can you do for me? Pardon. What can you do for me if I visit your company? If you visit my company, first of all, I can give you a coffee cup. After, I can give you a tour around the production area. And I can show you the human resource department and introduce you with a human resources manager. Ah, okay, very good, very good. Uh, just a little thing, uh, Galileo. Yeah. I heard that you said the most better uh, products or pizza or something like that. Okay. Yeah, I, I said just... the uh, more delicious products to eat. Oh, okay, that's fine. But I heard the most better. Ah, okay. Uh, and and actually, the, the most better pizza. Yeah. Yeah, but the the you. The best way to say that is the best. Yeah, the best. The best is the top. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Hey, very good. Very good. Okay, Galileo. Now you continue asking to someone else, please. Choose okay. your class, your, your partner. Uh Wendy. Wendy Maribel. Okay. Okay. Uh, number one, where can I find you if I visit your company? You can find me in second desk. Okay, number two, what can I get from your company? From my company, you get air, air tickets. Okay, number three. What can you do for me if I visit your company? In my company, give you travel adversary. Okay, thank you. Travel, travel what? And no sé cómo se pronuncia, pero el buque asesoría. Adverse o adverse, no sé cómo dice. Advisory. Advisory, okay. Advice. Ah, okay. My company give you travel advisory. Ah, okay. Okay, very Thank good. You, Wendy. Now, continue you, Wendy. Do someone else to practice. Okay. Brian, Javier. Hey, Brian. People, turn on your cameras. Exito. The internet is the same. Thank you. The electricity bill is going to be the same, people. Turn on your cameras, please. This is a for requirement. Okay, Wendy, ask the questions to Brian. Okay. Where can I find you if I visit your company? You can me at at the reception. Uh -huh. oh. What can I get from your company? Uh, school information for that is education. Okay. What can you do for me if I visit I visit your company? Um, visit the place we can take a coffee <laughs> talk about the the my experience in my work okay very good continue Brian quickly please uh Maida está por ahí who si sí, estoy por aquí okay there <laughs> okay go ahead Brian Maida 
Where can I find you if you visit your company? I visit the bus office. I visit the warehouse. I visit the sales room. What can I get for your company? I can electrical material. And what can you do for me if I visit your company? Excellent price and good quality of products. Okay. Continue, Myra. Mm, quiero ver. Mm, Ana Lilian. Okay. Está por ahí? Yes, she's here. Yes, I just saw it. Right. Ana Lilian, where can I find you if, if I visit your company? We are in the down to neighbor uh, cinema street between entre Banco Agrícola y Atlántida. Algo así entendí que es la pregunta, como que dónde me encuentro, ¿verdad? No, kind of. Aha. Uh -huh. Continue, Myra. What can I get from your company? You can get a, a good service related relate to car uh, procedures and parcel ships. ¿Cómo se dice, teacher, para decir que puede ayudar en los procesos relacionados a cuestiones de carro? Pues, pero ¿qué? qué a qué? trámites, trámites relacionados ah. con, con carros. Eh, o sea, lo escribí así, pero no sé. Es bien With chulo. Car, uh, I don't know, transactions. Car documentation, car, yeah, something like that. Conseguía trans. Transactions. Transaction. Car transaction. Hard. Paperwork. Hard. Paperwork. Esa papelería, paper. esa documentación, oh. paper paperwork. Paperwork. Mm -hmm. Paperwork. Okay. And the last question. What can you do for me if I visit your company? Hi, can I help you uh, with the orientation on some processes? Processes, teacher, procedures. Procedures. Procedures also help, help you to send or receive something from your reliable in the unit estate. Okay. Okay, good. Okay, Anna Lilian, now you continue asking the questions to someone else. We have new students, make them participate, please. We have Mauricio, Rocio, Jacqueline, Dinora, Catherine, Who? Catherine. Okay, Catherine. You have the questions, Anna Lilian? Uh, where can I find you if you visit your company? Um, if you visit my company, you can find me in the reception or in the lobby. Okay. What can I I get is visit your company. If you visit my company, you get a financial uh, service and the best saving account. Okay. What can you do for me if I visit your company? Um, I can help you to with your um, work play, work papers, and, and maybe I 
I can you um, don't wait a lot of time in the in the bank. Only okay. That. Okay, very good. Now you, Catherine, continue with someone else, please. Okay, we um Laura Carolina. Okay. Present. Okay. Hi. Okay. Hi. <laughs> uh, give me a second, please. Where can I find if you ah oh, sorry, when can I find? If you if I visit your company, uh, if if you visit my company, you will you will find me on the team floor of the Torre Futura. Okay. okay. What can I get for your company? Uh, I can get advice. advice on investment, retirement plan, life insurance, credit and debit card, among other financial services. Okay. What can you do for me if I visit your company? I can, I, I can introduce you to the investment in insurance specialists. I can also offer you a good interest on your investment. Okay, thank you. Business okay. people, ah, pay attention. Business. <laughs> Negocio. <laughs> Bitcoins, Bitcoins. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, este, um, you quiero, know, uh, um, ay, María Concepción. Uh -huh. Okay. <laughs> Ok, María Concepción. Eh, Hi. Hola. Where can I find you if, if I visit your company? You can find me in the third level of the administra administrative area. Ok. Eh, what can I get from your company? Good care. You can you can get my medicine, beauty products, among other things. Okay. Uh, what can you do for me if I visit your company? I will offer you a hot drink, or if you prefer a glass of water. Okay. Thank you. Excellent. Okay, Mary, can you please continue? Uh, Guillermo. Oh. Sí. Okay. Where can I find you if I visit your company? Uh, we are located in El Plan de la Laguna. Uh, in Antigua Pujatlán and in the commercial centers of the country. What can I get from your company? Excellent quality clothing. What can you do for me if I visit, I visit your company? Our co collaborate collaborators will attend to to with kidneys and will help you choose the best garment. Okay, very good. Continue, Guillermo. Oh. La, las preguntas no las tengo, teacher. Ahí está en el chat. Uh, es que sa me sacó la plataforma y he vuelto a entrar, entonces no tengo nada. Sorry. Ah. Ok, let me share again. Las reenvío, teacher. 
Sorry, I am. I stand on my own. Okay, okay, okay. Thanks. Uh, Wendy. Wendy, ya pasó. Okay. Uh, we have um, Jacqueline, Rocio, Mauricio, Dinora. Uh, Mauricio. Okay, Mauricio Antonio Orellana. Or Mauricio Antonio okay. Rivera. No. Er Rivera. Ah, Rivera. Okay. Ready. Pero se te escucha bien suave, Mauricio. Voy a salir de... Espérenme. Ahorita arreglo el audio. Hello. Sí. Ya. <laughs> no sé, él dijo que iba a salir, no sé dónde. Oh. Mauricio. Hola, hola. Ajá, un poco mejor. Ok. Ok, Guillermo, go ahead. Where can I find you if I visit your company? Uh, in the warehouse, low level. No sé, algo pasa con tu micrófono que se te escucha bien suave. In the warehouse. In the warehouse, uh, low level. Okay, good, better. Continue, Mo Guillermo. What can I get from your company? Many discount, discount on, uh, on product to install in the electric electricity area, and we give free copy. What can, what can you do for me if I visit your company? Many electrical uh, products. To Who is the... in, uh, many, many electric products to install in my area, especially cables. Okay. Okay, people, we are going to stop here. We have to continue with the rest um, with something different, okay? So it is important that you pay attention when this pra we practice this way because you you are training your listening, okay? You, I know this sometimes is difficult, but you need to to try to understand what your classmates are saying, okay? So that is part of the learning process. Okay, tonight we are going to talk about something different. Let me go to the book. Okay, I need to share this the screen. Okay. Tonight's class, we're going to learn to ask and give information about one's or other's shipments. Ask and give information about shipments. Okay. Uh, do you know what is the meaning of shipments? Who can tell me what is the meaning of shipments? Envio. Envios, okay. Envio. What uh, methods does your company use to send products or materials? How do how does your company send 
products or materials to others. Come on, can you tell me? With, with, with messenger. With messengers? Ah, oh, okay. What about, um, I don't know, let's see. Uh, um, your companies. Yes. How do they, what methods, what they use to send the products or to receive products also? DHL. DHL. So that is a. That is a courier, courier, a courier DHL. service like DHL. Okay. In my case, WhatsApp and email. My product is is Victor, virtual. In virtual. <laughs> ah, yes. Okay. Electronic services. Services. Yeah. The, all the tickets now are electronic. Yes. Yeah. Teacher. Yeah. Can they have teacher? Me, how do you say like a uh, correo traditional? But in my case, in my company, uh, they use Aeroflash, but it's a um, correo traditional. It's the, the mail. It's mail. the email. The mail. No, mail, mail. Mail. Uh -huh. Mail. Oh. Only the mail. Oh, okay. Thank you. A regular mail. You could say. A regular mail. Regular mail. So to make the difference with email. Okay. Yeah, email is like I use internet. Yes, but this is regular mail. Okay, thank you. We are talking about package, right? Packages, no. uh -huh. or, or products. Okay, because uh, information uh, or email. Yeah. But but, but in a, in case in my case I use the messenger very often. Yeah, you send documents uh, with messengers. In my case in teacher, people. In my case in, in my work the the company use unit uh, send delivery or USD. USD. Sí. El I es unidad de servicio para entrega. Unit service delivery. Oh, okay, okay. I was thinking USD there. No, USD. The flight rights. <laughs> okay, USD. Ah, okay. So you have your own delivery system. Yeah. Your own delivery service, okay. About route. Okay. Uh huh. And I don't know. Your company gets products from others. You buy products from others. How do you receive? How does your company receive those products? Products from, from abroad, from another another country. Uh, who uh, whose company receives products from another country? In my uh, company, in my company, uh -huh. about shipping. Okay, Galileo. Yeah, in our case, the ninety-five percent of our products come from USA. Yeah. Uh, okay. uh, California, most frequently. Okay, so and they come by ship, by plane, uh, by truck. We ship in via uh, sea, sea maritime. Ah, okay. Okay. Uh, uh, we we ship full containers. Um, in BSC and uh, come to arrive to Guatemala, Santo Tomate Castilla, and 
um, for the road until frontera uh, border with El Salvador uh, until our warehouse. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So interesting. It's interesting information. So tonight we're going to learn a little bit about that. Uh, those different methods or some some information about shipping. Okay. Well, let me share again the screen. Let's take a look to um, a sample of a shipping label. Yeah, I will show you another one I have, I download from internet, another shipping label. But look at this one. Yeah, what information do we have in this shipping label? So first we have the sender or who sends the product. Okay, the sender is Travers Inc. And the address is 23 Glenway, San Carlos, uh, California, 0570. Okay. Um, if we split this address, this is the name of the company. Robbers Inc. Yeah. And the rest is the address. This is the sender. The sender, yes. The person or company who sends the product. Okay. okay. Then we have the address. What information do we have in the address? 23 Glenway. What is 20, the 23? What is the 23? Maybe the street? No. Postal, postal call? No. We have 23 Glenway. Glenway is the street. 23 is the number of the building. Okay. Yeah, the number of the building. What is San Carlos? City. The city, yes. City. California. The state. state. The state. 0570. Postal, postal code. code. Postal code or zip, zip. code. Mm -hmm. Zip code. So this is the information you have in an address, especially in, in, in the United States. So first is the number of the building, the numero del edificio, the street, in this case is Glenway. No, there are other abbreviations for for streets. Um, so this is Glenway. Hay otras que pueden ser road, yeah, or avenue, or street, or street, or boulevard, pasaje. <laughs> Uh, no, I haven't heard uh, anything like pasaje. <laughs> so street or way. Block. Uh, uh, block is something different, actually. No, rarely. No, well, actually, I, I have never heard. Uh, como acá, verdad, que en las casas tenemos polígono. Block. Verdad, block. Pero yo en inglés nunca he escuchado algo así. Excepto cuando son complejos de, de condominios. Por ejemplo, ¿no? que cada edificio también tiene su número. Y dentro del edificio está el apartment. ¿verdad? 
ahí son las diferentes lo que puede escuchar no uh, el número del edificio building 23 apartment 40 no tal vez pero así que blog polígono casi siempre es número del, del edificio de la casa calle eh, ciudad estado y el zip code ese sí es bien importante ¿no? porque por ahí lo ubican ubican muchas cosas con el zip code ok What else? Se, escucha, se escucha mucho el ruido tiche. en serio sí no sé si solo seré yo que lo escucho Sí, se oye por ahí un televisor pero no, no lo oigo muy fuerte pero igual vamos a cerrar los micrófonos un momento si necesitan eh, lo activan si necesitan preguntar algo ok Uh, different uh, to means the the uh, uh, the receiver, okay? El que lo recibe, no? Literal road number thirty-four, La Unión, El Salvador. Made in the U.S. This is an important number, no? El tracking. Number, tracking number es el número de rastreo de su, de su paquete, el tracking number. Uh, quantity, shipment, que hay un número del, del embarque o del envío. Sender, es un código, es un código del, del remitente. Esto es manufacturing o manufacture date, la fecha de fabricación. Puede haber, puede venir o no, ¿verdad? depende de lo que sea. El peso, net weight, 120 pounds. Básicamente. Eh, por aquí cargué una, una imagen como para ver otro ejemplo and you see this one from so the sender here you have the sender SJ Systems you see 100 is the building number Somerset Corporate Boulevard Oh, esta es la calle. Bridgewater, the city. Uh, New, New Jersey, is the state. And the zip code, 08807. Yeah. Uh, the ship date, la fecha en que se envió. The weight, 65 pounds. This is the receiver. Yeah, MB distributing. Again, the address, look. 100 is the building number. Technology Drive is the street. Broomfield is the city. CO, I think, is Colorado, is the state. A0021 is the zip code. Then the tracking number. Yeah. And the um, ETA. Se puede, usualmente puede que vean esta abreviación. ETA. It is estimated time of arrival. Teacher. Hola. Hola. Eh, 
está compartiendo otra imagen. Así no la están viendo. No. Oops. Sorry. No se supone que sí, pero bueno. Estamos en la misma de hoy sí. Hoy sí. Vale, repito ya. entonces lo que dije acá. La verdad, esta es una imagen de otra eh, viñeta, una label. Recuerden, viñetas son labels. ¿no? Tenemos el sender, SJ Systems. The street, or, or the building number, 100. The street number, Somerset Corporate Boulevard. The city, Bridgewater. The state, New Jersey. The zip code, 08807. Que vean lo misma, la misma distribución de la dirección del receiver. Okay. The name, MB Distributing. 100, el número del local, del edificio. Technology Drive, la calle. Broomfield, la ciudad. CO es eh, Colorado. El zip code, A00221. Luego el tracking number. También tenemos de ship date, la fecha de envío, el peso y la est estimated time of arrival. Estaba poniendo acá que esto muchas veces solo aparece como ETA. ¿Qué es eso? Estimated time of arrival no el tiempo estimado de eh, llegada no puede aparecer así como ETA y esa es la información básica so the basic information you can see in a label of shipping all right Now, let me uh, show you a brief conversation about this. Okay, can you see the conversation? Yes. Okay, okay. As I told you, I work in the mornings as an interpreter for different companies. And usually, um, I receive calls from the United States Postal Service. So this is uh, the acronym for the Postal Service of the United States, okay? USPS, United States Postal Service. And this is a common type of conversation between uh, postal service agent and a client now who wants to know where the the package or the product is okay let me show you let me show you this conversation um, okay Good morning. Thank you for calling USPS. I'm Andrea. How can I help you today? I'm calling to note the status of a package I sent two days ago. Uh, sure, I'm glad to help you. May I have the tracking number, please? It is 5030007896. Five, 
Uh, can you verify your first and last name and your address, please? Including your zip code? Uh, my name is Samuel Jimenez and my address is 4589 Wilson Avenue, San Francisco, California, 94122. And may I have a good phone number to call you back if necessary? Yes, 415-789-3401. Thank you very much, Mr. Jimenez. Your package is on, in our office and is going to be delivered to your home tomorrow morning. Is there anything else I can help you with? No, that's fine. Thank you very much for the information. Thank you for calling USPS. Have a good rest of your day. So this is a typical conversation between an agent and a customer who wants to now information about the status of a, um, a package, okay? So I will, uh, well, first, I don't know if you have any question with this conversation. So if you see, we have a tracking number, which is common. Is the first thing they're going to ask you. Then they usually ask you for, um, information to verify you are the person uh, or the receiver of the of the product no and they usually ask you for the name your name and and your address uh, they usually ask you for a good phone number to contact you just in case the the call is disconnected or or if they need to call you back. For a phone number, it's very important the area code, the, the first three digits are the area code for the city, which are these, and then the phone number. Okay. Any question with these people? Any question with the conversation? No, say any question. Okay. Let me share this screen with you. Let me share this in WhatsApp. Okay, you have the conversation in WhatsApp and I will give you a few minutes to practice that conversation in pairs, okay? But first I'm going to take the second attendance. So please turn on your cameras and respond when I call your name. Ana Lilian Reyes. Present. Thank you, Brian Javier Carmona. Brian Javier Carmona. Present teacher. Okay, Dinora Alejandra Alfaro. Present teacher. Okay, Frida Janine Mejia. Present teacher. Okay, Gabriela Irene Menjivar, no. Guillermo Antonio Garcia. Present. Eh, Javier Aldair Escobar. Present teacher. Uh, Jose Arnoldo Mazariego. Present. Arnold, ok. 
Okay, Jose Galileo Barrera. Present. Good. Jose Jonathan Vigil. Jose Jonathan Vigil. Present teacher. Okay. Jose Rodrigo Hernández. Present teacher. Catherine Marcela Castaneda. Catherine Marcela. Chair. Laura Carolina Vigil. Present teacher. María Concepción Cerón. Present teacher Catherine. Ok, Catherine. María Ivania Palma. Present. Good. Mauricio Antonio Rivera. Present teacher. I'm here. Ok. Mayra Veralice Moreno. Present teacher. Ok. Zaira Marlene Hilarín. Present. Okay. Wendy Maribel Zabaleta. Present teacher. Good. Jacqueline Gloribel Rivas. Present. Ok. Elías Ael Matute. No. Karen Vanessa Morataya. Present. Ok. Mauricio Antonio Orellana. Present. Ok. Rocío Lourdes Pimentel. Present. And Jocelyn Joana García. Okay, let's practice the conversation and then I'm going to send you to practice in pairs. Okay, repeat after me, please. Let me get the arrow to show you. Okay, repeat. Good morning. Thank you for calling USPS. I'm Andrea. How can I help you today? Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. I am Andrea. Yes. Okay. Yes. I'm Andrea. Andrea, how can I help you today? I'm calling to know the status of a package I sent two days ago. I'm calling to know the status of a package I sent two days ago. Sure, I'm glad to help you. May I have the tracking number, please? Sure. I'm glad to have the tracking number, please. Taking number, please. Okay. Taking number, please. Taking number, please. Taking number, please. It's 5030007896540. It is 5030007896540. Five, five, zero, 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 can you verify your first and last name and your address, please, including your zip code? Can you verify your first and last name and your address, please, including your zip code? My name is Samuel Jimenez and my address is 4589. Wilson Avenue, San Francisco, California, 94122. And may I have a good phone number to call you back if necessary? Yes, 415-789-3401. Yes. One. Thank you very much, Mr. Jimenez. Your package is in our office and is going to be delivered to your home tomorrow morning. Is there Thank anything you, else Mary. I can help you with? Thank you, Thank you very much, Mr. Jimenez. Mr. Jimenez. Mr. Jimenez. The package is in our office and is going to be delivered to your home tomorrow morning. Is there anything else I can help you with? I can help you with. 
No, that's fine. Thank you very much for the information. No, that's no, fine. That's Thank, fine. You Thank, Thank you very much for the information. Thank you very much for the information. Thank you for calling USPS. Have a good rest of your day. Thank you for calling USPS. Okay, very good. Okay, now I'll send you to work in pairs. And I want you to practice this conversation two or three times, okay? Very good. So practice this conversation.
Okay, welcome back. Any question with the conversation? No questions? With the pronunciation, no problem. Okay, very good. Okay, let's go here. Teacher. Hola. Mire, la pregunta, yo tenía una, una, la pronunciación de status, o sea, status, o, o ¿cómo no, sería? es status. Status, status, yeah, ok. Status. Okay. ok, thank you, teacher. Okay, in this label, we have um, four questions here. What is the shipping address? In this label. What is the shipping address? 784. No, in the label that we have in the book. Um, you look into this label? Traverse Inc. Traverse Inc. is the shipping address? No, it's literal road. La Unión El Salvador. Yes, literal road, La Unión, number 34, La Unión El Salvador. This is the shipping address. Okay. Mm. What's the meaning shipping address? A ver. Dirección de envío. Dirección de envío. Correct. Thank you. Number two, what is the mailing address? Traversing. Traversing, Glenway, San Carlos, California. How many units are in the package? 65. 65 units. 65. And what is the manufacturing date? April 12. April 12. What? 2013. Well. Uh, in this lesson, we're going to study a little bit or we're going to refresh or review how to use be going to. Remember that be going to is to talk about future. Yeah, future, be going to. I have some examples here. I am going to give you the information. The airline is going to transport the shipping. Your packages are going to arrive tomorrow. Where is the package going to arrive? Who is going to deliver it? And the negative form is simple, we only add not. I'm not going to give you the information. The airline is not or isn't going to transport the shipping. And your packages aren't going to arrive tomorrow. But I also want to show you the different forms of be going to. Affirmative, negative, yes, no question, and information questions. Affirmative, your order is going to be ready. 
let me see if I can write uh, the uh, structure, basic structure for affirmative sentences. Your order, your order is the subject. Then after the subject, we are going to use what happened? Be going to yeah. and after that the verb. Okay. So this is the structure for be going to. Let me see if I can change the color of this. Okay. Subject, be going to and the verb. Then the negative or structure is again subject plus B plus not not going to plus verb. Yeah, the negative form, subject, your order. B is not going to and the verb for yes no question we start with b then subject then going to and the verb. Is my order going to be ready? And the information question, we start with the WH word. This case is what time B plus subject plus going to plus verb. This is the structure for information questions. Okay. Any question with this? If not, let me... Okay. Let me share this here. Ahí se los pongo en WhatsApp, ese cuadrito. And I will give you 10 minutes 
to complete the sentences, okay? You have the affirmative here. So you have to complete with the negative, the yes, no question, and the information question. Vean la respuesta corta de las yes, no question. Is my order going to be ready in one hour? Yes, it is. Okay. Las respuestas cortas. Okay. Bueno, los voy a poner a trabajar en, en grupos para que completen este cuadrito y luego lo revisamos. ¿Alguna pregunta? Bueno. Let me form the groups. New groups to work in. Okay, groups of three. Okay, go ahead.
Pero como tiene que ser relacionado a lo que está ahí, va. Uh -huh. O sea, en la primera I fue what time is or porque decía in one hour. Hello, teacher. How can how Ajá, ajá. En la segunda, teacher. En uh -huh. I am not going to say eh, la negativa. Pero eh, para formar la yes or no question, eh, hicimos, la escribimos así, is you going to stay? Is, and, no sé si... Eh, is you? Está bien, o is I am. O is am. Uh -uh. No. I'm I, sería. I'm going to. Am. Um, I. Eso estaría mejor. Mm. Um, I, Pero si, osa, si usan you. Estamos cambiando todo. No. Yes, Pero, I can. <coughs> what is the form of be? For you. For you is. Mm -mm. No. Are. Uh -huh. Why? Condiciones. Are you? No, is you? Okay. La dejamos así o o dejamos con el. Am. I am. Um, I. Solo cambiamos el are, ya estuvo. Are okay. you? Are you? Yes. Are you? Mm. Y este, profe. Hola. Para, para responder, está bien que haya puesto yes, I can. No. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. You can. No. no. You are. No, no. no estamos usando can. Sorry, sorry. Yes, yes, I am. Oh, no, yes, you are. Depende, si van a estar jugando ahí con el I am, are you. Depende. No, si usted pregunta, no. are you going to send this envelope via UPS? ¿Cómo se responde eso? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Pero como en ese caso estamos usando el you, entonces es you are. No, porque es... No, porque le está preguntando a usted, entonces usted Ajá. debe contestar como I am. Exacto. No lo veo, te he está bueno, está bueno. <risa> es que eso confunde, teacher. <risa> Tenemos que regresar. <risa> Porque el, el tubino ya nos lo confundimos. <risa> a ver, a ver. Yes, I am. Ok, see you. See you. See you. What is she going to receive this week? The document. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. In this case, seria who is going to the sh to ship the package to her jet? Going to mm -hmm. Don't mm -hmm. Subject. Very good. The sales department uh, is going to ship the package to Japan. I think on a lot the sales department 
is not going to cheap okay cheap the package to Japan so the parent is going to achieve the package to Japan okay este uh, uh, sí ¿Digo? no en el, en la en la tres que en when is going to recite by the document qué excelente qué excelente la verdad qué aprovechar está como buen día la verdad muy cansado o sea, pero tratando de, de, de sacar ánimos, la verdad. Yo estoy bien entusiasmado con el programa de inglés, porque realmente, como le decía yo, como lo he manejado desde que comencé, esto creo que va a abrir oportunidades a futuro. Sí, bastante. Hay que echarle ganas, hay que echarle ganas. Ya que no tuvimos lo, los medios. Sí. Perdón, Karen. Teacher. Teacher, we finished. Oh, okay. Any question? Yes. No, no. No. We don't have a question. Okay. Estamos bien. Yes. You check the answer or we finish? We're going to check together. If you want, you can practice just reading to practice pronunciation. You can take turns okay. to read the sentences to practice. Okay. 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 See you. See you. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Who is going to ship the package to Japan? The sales department. The sales department. Teacher. Esta sería así como the subject sería the sales department en la última. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes, the sales department. Las primeras dos las hicimos juntos y las últimas eh, nos hemos. Ana Lilian está haciendo la tercera y yo hago mm -hmm. la cuarta y después nos la vamos interchange. Ok. The sales department. Mm -hmm. Department is going. Very good. See you. See you, teacher. are going to receive the document. The document is whip. Ah, yo creo que ya nos habían sacado. Ajá, yo también. Y me dejo un sol. Pero we're not going to receive the document. This whip, ¿verdad? This week, sí. Uh -huh. Ya la W question sería. The, the this week. week. The W question. Entonces, sería... yes, the questions. Ahí está. Y info. 
info question sería podría ser uh, what what is she going to receive this week the document como la que respuesta que sería a... the document ajá ajá como diciendo qué es lo que va a recibir esta semana los documentos Sería, what is she going to receive this week? What is W H A T, ¿verdad? What is she going to receive this week? Going to receive receive the the document mm -hmm. y la última sería esta es who is going to ship the package Oh. <risa> ah, no, todavía no han pasado el tiempo. O oh, si sí, ya tienen, tenemos que regresar, ¿no? Pensé que teníamos que regresar. ¿Cuándo vas a entrar el producto? Cher. Hello. Este, fíjese que me sacó el, 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 el sistema de Zoom, me sacó. Y me ha costado entrar otra vez. Ahorita ya entré otra vez, pero no sé cómo van mis compañeros. Ya vamos por la segunda. Eh, ah, estoy ya. compartiendo todo en, en, en el chat para que puedas visualizar. Y si me das algún inconveniente, solo me decís para yo poder compartírtelo de nuevo. Va, ok, gracias. Okay. Teacher, I have a question. Mm, tell me. Ok. Um, en segundo bloque. Eh, ya en las preguntas informativas, eh, no sé si se escucha bien esto y usted me corrige. Eh, yo le puse, when they are going to deliver the products this week. No sé si se escucha bien, teacher. A el orden para empezar, al principio. Ajá. Ajá. ¿Cómo debe ser el orden? Al principio de la pregunta. Way, when are going and are, to deliver? When are they uh -huh. going to? Espera, Sería where are. Sería when. They, uh -huh. when. When are when. they going to deliver the products this week? Así sería. ¿Y cuál es la respuesta? In, sin el this week. Ajá. Ah. Cabal. Me estás metiendo la respuesta en la sí. pregunta. Ajá, cabal. Entonces solo, solo sería así como, when are they going to deliver the products? Ajá. Ok. Eh, the next year. Ok. Um, ese era como el, el inconveniente que tenía Tisha. Pero, um, <coughs> quiero ver. Is she going to the receive? Bueno, vamos por la tercera entonces. Eh, quedaría así básicamente. Eh, Jacqueline. <risa> Sí. Ok. Um, quiero ver para la tercera. Tercer bloque. Hey, see you. See you, to sure.
Okay, people, welcome back. Any question with the exercise? No? It's clear? If you have any question, ask now. It's difficult, the order, teacher. The order. Yes. Well, now practice, 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 practice. Practice, practice, practice. Remember the order for questions is maybe the most difficult. Yeah, WH word, subject, or follow the structure. So that is that is the idea to give you the structure. Okay. Okay, people, we are going to check uh, tomorrow and we are going to practice a similar conversation as the model I gave you. No, tomorrow, because it's time to stop tonight. And remember the platform I was checking before the class today. And some of you still have zero in the platform. Algunos todavía no han hecho nada en la plataforma. Y ya mañana, la medianoche, ya tiene que estar hecho toda la sección 1. ¿Verdad? Que son cinco ejercicios, cinco tareas. ¿Todos tienen acceso ya a la plataforma? ¿Hay alguien que tiene problemas para entrar a la plataforma? No, ¿verdad? Perfecto. Entonces, eh, no hay, no, no se atrasen con eso, por favor. Quédense hoy ahí trabajando unos minutos en los ejercicios, son las tareas son sencillas, son cinco ejercicios a mayoría de solo de marcar en los que haya que escribir algo, eh, tengan cuidado al escribir, que vaya bien escrito, no pongan más de lo que se les pide para que no se los tome como malo, recuerden que es un sistema automatizado entonces una letra de más, un espacio de más un punto de más ¿Verdad? O algo, una cosa que falte, se lo va a tomar como malo. Entonces, tiene que estar bien, bien hecho, ¿Verdad? Si es pregunta, un signo de interrogación, si es, si no es pregunta, ¿Verdad? No pongan signos de interrogación o, en fin, tengan cuidado con esos detallitos a la hora de escribir las respuestas en la plataforma para que no se las tome como malas. Si hay mayúscula, si no hay mayúscula, ¿verdad? Pongan atención en esos detalles. Porque por esas cositas a veces las toma como mala. Y dice, mire, yo le pongo la respuesta correcta, pero me lo tomo como mala. A veces hay un problema de una letra o de un espacio. Al final, ¿verdad? Que tal vez está de más. Bien, <ríe> paso la última asistencia. Y hoy le toca la sesión... ¿A quién les había dicho? A Jonathan. Y mañana sí. a Wendy Maribel. Ok. Nos quedamos okay. unos minutitos, Jonathan. Ok, rapidito, Ana Lilian Reyes. Present. Brian Javier Carmona. Present. Dinora Alejandra Alfaro. Present teacher. Frida Janine Mejía. Present teacher. Gabriela Irene. No está. Guillermo Antonio García. Eh, Javier Aldair Escobar. Present teacher. José Arnoldo Mazariego. José Arnoldo. Present teacher. Ok. José Galileo Barrera. Present. Ok. José Jonathan Vicil. Present teacher. José Rodrigo Hernández. Present. 
Catherine Marcela Castaneda. Present teacher. Laura Carolina Vigil. Present teacher. María Concepción Cerón. Present teacher. María Ivania Palma. María Ivania. Mauricio Antonio Rivera. Present teacher. I'm here. Mayra Veralice Moreno. Present. Zaira Marlene Larín. Present. Wendy Maribel Zabaleta. Present. Ok, Jacqueline Gloribel Rivas. Present. Uh, Elías Ael. Karen Vanessa Morataya. Present. Mauricio Antonio Orellana. Present. Rocío Lourdes Pimentel. Present. Jocelyn Joana Garcia. Okay, people. Please complete the exercises in the platform and see you tomorrow at the same time. Okay. Have a good night. Goodbye. Take care. God bless you. See you later. God bless you, God bless you too. Bye. God bless you. Okay. Blessings to everyone. Sweet dreams. <clears throat> okay, Jonathan, how are you? Hi, teacher. How is everything, Jonathan? Um, so so. Why? Why is not perfect? Uh, um, the word is uh, a little hard today because oh, really? my bus is on vacation oh mm, because um today uh, there was uh, some some requirements for the users um today there was some problems with uh, some process. Okay. But it is work. <laughs> yeah. That's why they hire you. <laughs> yes. <laughs> to solve those problems. Yes. Yes. This is my, my, this is my, my work. And you like it? I like it. You like your, your job? Yes, I like it. Okay, so that's good. And you, do you like your work? Work? Oh, yes. I enjoy this. <laughs> <laughs> I image. Yeah, image it's, it's easy money. <laughs> easy money, really? <laughs> yeah. When you enjoy what you do, is Yeah. It's easy. It's um, easy. Yeah. <laughs> These cats are very noisy. Ah, um, today my kitty is lost. Was lost. Really? Really. But they... I don't know what happened with with <clears throat> him, with she. Oh, it's a girl? Yes, it's a girl. Ah, but she must be the parranda. <laughs> ah, ojalá. Uh, yeah. I wish, I wish. My cat, well, she had never lost before. Only like two or three months ago, she disappeared for two days. Ah, really? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I, 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 I have, uh, um, how do you say Esperanza? Hope. Hope. Uh -huh. I have hope them because yeah. uh, it's a first day. Um, it's a, um, yeah, and, and uh, yeah, this cat had never done that before. So she went out during the day, but come back 
and sometimes at night and but come back in the morning she, or but every come day, back yeah she she but my two days but my by um my kid is uh three no um seven months ah oh, he's very uh, young yes <laughs> He's very he's, young. He's, he's young. He's very young. Yeah, but seven months. Well, it's, it's, it's difficult for a cat to get lost. Yes. It's difficult. So they always find a way home. <laughs> and this cat, the, those after those two days, she came very hungry and very dirty. Yeah, she has been with a lot of cats, definitely. <laughs> okay. And now she has four, four kitties. <laughs> four kitties. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, if I don't, if I don't find my kid, you can. I can give you one. <laughs> give me one. <laughs> I can give you one. And they are messing around here tonight my office is her their bedroom <laughs> ah. <laughs> yeah okay uh, jonathan how do you how, how can i help you with the class or is there something that you would like to to practice a little bit more until moment i i don't have question um is clearly Okay, okay, so let's keep talking. Let's practice speaking. Okay. <clears throat> Is correct clearly or how do you say clearly? It? Clearly, yeah, clear. Everything is clear. You can say that. And, and tell me a little bit more about you. So you live with your family, you have children, and... Yes, I have two children. How old are they? Um, three, five, and one year. Oh, you have three kids. Ah, kids. Kids, children. Ah, yes, yes. Yeah. Yes. Uh, boys, girls? Two girls and one boy. The baby is the boy? Baby. Ah, you were looking for the boy. <laughs> <laughs> no, one boy and two girls. Ah. Yeah. So, the first one is boy? No, the first one is girl. Aha. Uh -huh. The second one? Is boy. Ah, and the third one? Girl. It's a girl. Ah, okay. Yes, what are girl. what are their names? Sarah. She's five. Yes, she five. Sarah is a uh, she five. Um Oscar. Huh? And Um, hey, come on, you forgot your... <laughs> Hi, <laughs> and everything. Everything. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, and, but, and... but they not live with me. Oh, they really? With, yes, it, uh, they are living with uh, uh, his mom. Their mom? Their mom, see. Oh, so you are separated? Yes. Oh. Yes. Um, um, some I month ago. One month ago? Um, four months ago. Four months ago. Yes. What, did, what did you do, Jonathan? <laughs> nothing. I nothing. Nothing. <laughs> nothing. Mm -hmm. Hard to nothing. believe. 
read no i don't i i didn't nothing i didn't do i didn't do nothing <laughs> yes oh um and you you have um child yes i have four four children four. yeah four children um but boys my, my baby my baby girl is 20. 20. oh <laughs> yes the, this that's the baby that well the first one is a girl she's married actually and really 20 years no 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 the first one is she's how old is she 28 she's 28 20, and 28. yeah she's married and she has one one daughter my first granddaughter Oh, okay. Yeah, she is six months old. My granddaughter. Six? Six months. Yeah. Eight meses. Yes. Six months. Oh. Yes. Then the second is another girl. She is 26 years old. And now she, she lives in San Salvador. She's she doesn't live with us with you no no she, she lives apart she's separate okay. she lives in san salvador my third one is a boy he's 24 he's a, a math mathematics teacher really yeah that's good yes and uh, he's looking for a job, actually. Still oh, looking for a job. Yeah, he graduated before the pandemic. So uh, then the pandemic came and has been difficult for him to, yes. to get a job. But uh, he went to an interview today. Maybe he get the nah. job. And my baby girl, she's 20. And she's working in a call center. Oh, nice. Yeah. Uh, how much time? Uh, how much time ago she's at uh, work? Oh, she's working since December. December. Yeah. She started seven months. Something Around like that. Seven months. Mm -hmm. Month. No. Nice. Yes, that's my family. And it's my good. my granddaughter. That's fine. We are very happy. Someday I, I, I will I will say <laughs> I have a a son with 30 years old. <laughs> yeah, you Time goes very fast. Yes, yes, I yeah. know. So, and if, if you can put your family together again, that would be great. Yes, I, I hope. Yeah, behave. <laughs> you know <laughs> what I mean? Behave, portate bien. Yes. <laughs> behave. Behave. Hey, yeah. can you spell that? It's B E H A V E. Behave. Behave. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Okay, Jonathan, it's been nice to, to talk with you. Thank you, yeah, but it's teacher. It's 10 15 right now. Okay. So whatever you need, so you know you can find me via WhatsApp, okay? Okay, teacher. Have a good night. You too. Take bye -bye. care, okay? Bye-bye. Thank you. You too.